struggling Manchester City fell behind to an 11th minute goal. Gordon Strachan lifted a free kick into the penalty box and Rod Wallace pounced to maintain his excellent strike rate of late. It's six goals in as many games for the United striker. The visitors' failure to defend at set pieces again proved that I'm doing on 22 minutes. Strachan's free kick eventually fell for Gary Speed to beat Tony Coton from 16 yards out. Steve McMahon could only head the ball into the path of David Weatherall and flicked it forward for Speed to fire home. Brian Horton's tactical switch at the interval worked to treat. Carl Griffiths replaced Fitzroy Simpson and nine minutes after the restart, he set up Mike Sheeran. City's fight back was underway. Sheeran lifting the ball into the roof of the net for his second goal in successive weekends. A defensive error by United defender Chris Fairclough allowed City to draw level. Carl Griffiths in the thick of action as he seized on to a suicidal back header to score the equaliser. Griffiths anticipated the mistake, raced on to the loose ball, and with the keeper already committed, he slotted home the chance from a tight angle. Brian Dean is beginning to show the Leeds faithful why Howard Wilkinson splashed out two and three quarter million pounds for him in the summer. He scored against City on the opening day of the season. He helped them stretch their unbeaten run to 13 games, with that winner five minutes from the end to halt their opponent's spirited revival. The result reduces Manchester United's lead at the top of the Premiership to 12 points. City, though, have now gone nine Premiership matches without a victory.